As far as making habits easy, there are a variety of things you can do, but the simplest one is just to scale your habits down to something that is very easy to do. And I, I like to recommend the two minute rule, which basically says you take whatever habit you're trying to build and you scale it down to something that takes two minutes or less to do. So do yoga four days a week becomes take out my yoga mat or read 30 books a year becomes read one page. And sometimes people resist that a little bit because they're like, okay, I know the real thing I want to do isn't take my yoga mat out, right? I know I actually want to do the workout. Like I'm not just looking to build this habit of taking this mat out all the time. So if it's a mental trick and I know it's a trick, like why would I fall for it? And if you feel that way, then my recommendation would be, well, actually in the beginning for the first few weeks, limit yourself to only two minutes. All you do is put your shoes on, running shoes on and step out the door and lock the door and then you walk back inside. Or all you do is take your yoga mat out. It sounds funny, but like for example, so I had a, I had a reader who he ended up doing this. He lost a, a lot of weight, lost over hundred pounds. And for the first six weeks, he only went to the gym for like five minutes and then he would leave. So he'd get in the car, drive to the gym, get out, do half an exercise, get back in the car, drive home. And it sounds ridiculous, right? It sounds you're like, okay, clearly this is not going to be the thing that gets this guy in shape. But when you step back for a second, you realize he was becoming the type of person that went to the gym four days a week. He was mastering the art of showing up. And I think that this is like a really deep truth about habits that gets overlooked a lot, which is a habit must be established before it can be improved, right? It has to become the standard in your life, your new normal, before you can worry about optimizing it or expanding it from there. If you don't become the type of person that goes to the gym for five minutes, you don't have a chance to be the person who stays for 45 minutes, five days a week. So. I think so often we're, we're so focused on finding the perfect diet plan or the ideal workout program. We're so focused on optimizing that we don't give ourselves permission to show up in a small way. But even if it's only for, you know, five minutes or five push push-ups or one uh, sentence that you write, do something so that you can master the art of showing up and make it your new normal. And then once you become that person, well, then you have a lot of options for expanding and improving from there.